Hello, hello, hello everyone. This is Cynthia Toet, Miss Flippit, your gypsy medicine woman. <clears throat> and your <laughs> TV host on Your Hidden Love Story right here on YouTube, right here at 9.30 Pacific Standard Time on Mondays. You can watch Your Hidden Love Story live <laughs> with me and whoever's in the chat. I've had a pretty consistent rate with the people in the chat and they keep coming back because they love the show so much. So let's see what the full moon in um, November says. It's in Taurus with a lunar eclipse going on at the same time. Woo -hoo -hoo, emotional challenges. Let's get those forced on us. Huh? <laughs> we can't figure it out. The universe is going to show us, right? Hmm. It says confidence is your key to success. There's a lion. The lion's showing up. It says you got to have confidence to have that success. So no matter what your emotional journey is, you have to make sure that emotional journey is on the higher vibrational one. <laughs> so we can feel that confident. Because confidence comes from the higher vibration. Let's see. Let's see. What else? What else? Well... The moon moonology cards <laughs> with the full moon and new moon reading. Yeah. Let's see, let's see. So I just did a little research, not much, but a little bit of research on the Taurus full moon in a lunar eclipse. And you know, like the Taurus, they like to um they like to know, they like to plan, they like to have a structured way. And then, um, I don't feel like I do, but <laughs> then, um, but I do. <laughs> There's just certain parts of my structure that, you know, <laughs> different. Let's see, the lunar eclipse has to do with you know, the emotional parts that we're not taking care of, the ones that we can't analyze, the ones that we've thought about and we're putting into work and we're just not uh, coming to the resolution or the full circle to whatever it is that was supposed to do for us. That's where the lunar eclipse comes in because we're going to mix it up. We're going to force this upon you. We're going to bring change upon you. So it's not anything you thought of. It's something that the universe is bringing forward to you. Ooh, 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 ooh. The universe is helping us out. <laughs> says if you can't figure this out, we're going to help figure it out for you. It's like pushes us through the change. Because, you know, we're, we're stubborn people, you know. We like to, you know, stay in the same vibration that we've known most of our life, right? <laughs> yeah, this full moon has to do. Our emotions are running high. It is. It's going to challenge us. It's those emotions that you think you have handled... Well, not the ones that you think that you have handled, the ones that you've been trying to work on or to manage or to handle or take care of and and you haven't been able to figure it out. Those are the ones that are going to come to the full surface and the universe is going to show you what to do with them. <laughs> yeah. Funny, I'm talking about emotions and that card comes up. Emotions are running high. Let those sexual emotions run high. How about that one? <laughs> Passionate and desired emotions. Let those ones run high. What's this one say? It says to meditate in. So, so as oh, oh, look at those two fishes there. So to stay in balance through why the emotions are running high through this cycle, just we have to like allow the universe to do what it's doing i mean it's forcing it upon us so we might as well surrender we might as well surrender to the event <laughs> so that's why we have to meditate through it close shut the mind down get the thought process out of there let the universe do its job 
You don't have to think about what it's going to do, just like you don't have to think about how it's going to provide air for us. We don't have to think about, you know, that at all. It just is. Let the universe do its thing right now. That's what it's saying. Otherwise, nothing will come of this situation. <laughs> um, communication is the key. So, having confidence with which you're communicating, otherwise nothing's going to come of the situation. If we don't flip our emotional story around to a better story, nothing will come of a situation. But emotions are running high and the universe is saying, hey, pause for a moment, trust in me. Trust in me to bring you the magical key. <laughs> That's what the universe wants you to know. Yeah, it's going to bring you the magical key. <laughs> This is a new romance. <laughs> Cycle begins. That's the magical key. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. And hold on to your vision, honey, because it's right on target. <laughs> a romance. Look at that. So the emotions are running high. Maybe it's on the emo <laughs> on the romance side, but um, it's letting you just. It's kind of wanting you to stay calm in the middle of chaos. Have confidence in what it is that you are going to communicate out. Hold on to that vision. Hold on to your romance vision too. <laughs> know that your vision that you've had is coming forward. Hold on to that vision that you have. The one that makes you feel radiant the one that makes you feel shiny the one that makes you like feel like as you're already living this happy ever after fairy tale dream hold on to that vision <laughs> i just love the cards yeah i do i do yeah Conclusions are within reach. So maybe you've been after, maybe it's a romance that you've been after for a long time that has never really kind of like solidified itself. It's never come to its full circle. It's never really got its full beginning. And um, that's what it's, it, the conclusion, it, that's going to happen. The, the, the romance is going to come in so you can, can have a conclusion to this <clears throat> journey you've been on. Where you've had to deal with a lot of your emotional self. Where you became confident in who you are. I would say this, this full moon's bringing in a form of communication that has to do with this new romantic love. <laughs> let's watch it happen let's watch it let's look let's watch the magic show play out oh the card on the ground to the one that wanted to know what the card is on the ground let's see work through your fears <laughs> so anything that you're afraid of with this new romance get over it <laughs> Anything that you're afraid of to communicate about, get over it. Anything that you're afraid of, just get over it. <laughs> just get over it. Just get over it. Just know that you are loved. Just know that you are safe. <laughs> it says your dreams need a practical plan okay so the universe is actually setting up a, a practical plan because you know 
it wasn't being done, but this is in the bulls there. It says, the universe needs a practical plan. It says, well, luck's on your side. <laughs> That's how the universe is taking care of this right now because we were in the lunar eclipse. It forces the emotional part that hasn't been uh, solidified, that hasn't come forward. It says, be bold. Be bold and make that first move. <laughs> Man, I feel like I've already made a lot of first moves. And I feel like I keep making a lot of first moves. <laughs> Can I just go to second base? <laughs> um, there has been a first move made to bring this communication in. Luck's on my side. <laughs> How about yours? So, anything else? Let's see what the bottom of the deck says. Nothing is yet set in stone. Nope, nothing is. And you have to just be okay with that. Nothing is set in stone. But that's okay. Because you're still here. You're still here today. You can live your life and play. And be full of joy and excitement and, and glee. And know that the universe is definitely out there providing something for you. Which, which uh, story are you going to grab onto? The one that makes you feel good? That's the one I'm going to grab onto every time. This is Cynthia Toet, Miss Flippet, your gypsy medicine woman. Yeah, your psychic life coach. <laughs> That's for sure. <laughs> I'm just going to name myself that. We're going to change that. I can only change my name so many times. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Um, remember to like, share, and subscribe. Hey, and anybody out there know this guy that I like? Oh, I don't even need to go there. There's already plans in action. I forgot. Oh, I didn't really forget. <laughs> How can I forget that? The most important date of my life. <laughs> Another one. <laughs> Have a beautiful day. Till next time. Bye-bye.